Okay, we have Bill Bullock with the University of Illinois, He's a professor, director of Product Innovation Research Lab. Ah, thank you very much. Thanks. So, and thanks for uh, for coming. I know uh, I think the first one of these I did. I was thinking back years ago. I think I'm beating the record. I think I had three people in a late afternoon Friday. You know, young young guy just starting out <laughs> presentation. So this is actually uh, very nice to uh, that, that that you stopped by. I. Uh, well, I have, if I have any particular answers, but I do have some interesting stuff that, to show you what uh, young minds are thinking in the way of electronic waste that can be done about it. Um, I don't want to preach to the congregation too much here, so I'll, I'll go pretty quickly through some of this, leave a little bit of time for discussion uh, at the end in case you have any, any questions on what we're doing at the university and some of the other stuff that I've been involved at. Um, I was thinking back also, I think, uh, I think it was about 15 years ago, I was last in... Um, Las Vegas, and uh, I got in late uh, late the other night, and I, I, I was too lazy to set my own alarm, so I called down. I'm old fashioned, and said, "Could you give me a wake up call at six uh, six o'clock?" And, and of course, the question came back, "A.M. or P.M.?" So I knew I was in Las Vegas when <laughs> when I got that that, that response. But um, uh, kind of moving on, uh, um, e waste is is the general topic of what I'm talking about today a little bit, and how, what we're doing. Some things we're trying to do and address at the uh, university with this uh, really interesting problem and, and really prolific problem, and, and the reason for many of you that are in business uh, because of, of this. But uh, and I'm sure you know if you don't, uh, this is all all the electronics and stuff that we throw away. The various definitions, but this is basically uh, how the EPA and others, you know, define what's electronic waste in, in this country. So. Uh, uh, who makes it? Well, we, we kind of all do. We have OEMs, the governments, uh, individuals, uh, and others that contribute to a particular problem. And it's really a global problem. I, I'm always looking for interesting statistics. There's some that say there's so many 747s weight-wise worth of, of e-waste per day that are discarded, et cetera, et cetera. But, uh, so I, I think it's always interesting to see um, uh, kind of the, it, it's a huge global problem uh, that we have. Um, uh, projected to increase uh, in some of the developing markets, the developing nations. Um, uh, I think 500% uh, uh, was, I believe, um, uh, uh, India uh, in, in various degrees in, in some of the other countries. And it's projected in just a few years they're going to produce more e-waste in the Western nations. So um, uh, the fact that those doors are always going to be open for shipping this stuff around the world might might be questionable a bit. They're going to have their own e-waste problems in, in these kind, and are beginning to have so as well. Um, the uh, CO2 from IT equipment equals that of the airline industry. Uh, it's a very polluting industry. Uh, 400 tons an hour, by some estimates, are are lost, never reclaimed, not really used. Um, just in cell phones alone, uh, 50 million tons per year are trashed. Uh, 150 million sold, 130 million thrown away. Uh, very few of those are, are recycled. Uh, we purchase a new one on average about eight, every 18 months. I've still got an old flip phone I'm trying to hang on to. I'm actually looking at some of the new, new phones. But, uh, so maybe you can give me some advice on what I should purchase there. But um, it, it's just a huge, huge problem. Um, about 80% of it from this country, uh, at least, and, and, and much in the, in the world goes to Asia by some estimates, uh, according to the uh, UN uh, commissions that, that study these issues worldwide. Um, about 85% is landfilled or incinerated in the United States. So, uh, so you're only tapping into about 15% of that recycle market and reuse market. Uh, and a really tragic um, statistic I ran across was estimated only 2% of the PCs are ever reused by anyone else. It's just a terrible waste of the uh, embed energy and all on those things. The, uh, 